Hey mathematics learners, welcome to Distance Learning with Lee, where I make learning mathematics super easy. So remember, on the previous video tutorial, I basically gave you guys this like, you know, um, nice, fun activity that you can do to just check to see if you are able to, you know, convert with a ratio scale to convert. Okay, so I'm just going to quickly do that um, on this video tutorial. It's just going to be like a, you know, a quick seven minute tutorial. Okay, so let's get started. So with A, you're given 1 is to 25,000, right? We want to convert now the 6 centimeters, which is the map measurement, into an actual distance. What do we need to do here? Simple, right? If you're given 1 is to, 1 is to 25,000, okay? The 1 represents the map, 25,000 represents the real. All that we need to do, just take the 6 centimeters, Okay, multiplied by, what is it that we want? We want the actual in this case, because we don't know what that is, ne? So we want the actual, so just multiply it by what you want, okay? Multiply by the real, 25,000 divided by one, okay? So what's your answer? So six centimeters multiplied by 25,000. What are we getting? We're getting 150,000 centimeters but remember they want our answer to be in kilometers okay so to get our answer in kilometers you're just going to divide by 100 divide by a thousand so divide by a hundred thousand therefore our final answer is just equal to 1.5 kilometers okay so it's 1.5 kilometers let's look at b okay we want to convert the 12 centimeters to 12 centimeters on the map to a value, an actual distance value, okay? So what do we do? Same thing here. Take the 12 centimeters. We are going to be using this ratio. Multiply by what we want. We want the actual, yeah? So we're going to multiply by 125,000 divided by 1, okay? Same thing, okay? You're going to get 1,500,000 centimeters then we need to convert this to meters because they're asking us to have our answer in meters so therefore you're just going to divide by 100 so if you divide by 100 you're going to get 15,000 meters good so this is 15,000 meters let's look at c so you're given the scale one is to five thousand you want what now you want the map measurement that's what they want there okay the map measurement so how do we get the map measurement we're just going to take that eight kilometers that's given to us multiply by what we want okay so we're going to multiply by the one represents the map so it's one divided by what we have which is five thousand Okay, I think at this point, you guys should know what's happening, okay? One represents map, the other value represents the real. Multiply by what you want, divide by what you have. So if you take 18, multiply it by 1, divide it by 5,000, what are you getting? You are getting 0 0.0036 kilometers. But remember, they're asking us to have our answer in centimeters. So if you're moving from kilometers to uh, centimeters, you're going to multiply by 1,000. Multiply by 100. Multiply by 1,000. Multiply by 100. What do you get? You get 360 centimeters. So our answer for that one there is 360 centimeters. Okay. Then let's look at number D. Okay. What's happening with D? Okay. So D, you're given 1 is to 40,000. Okay. 1 is to 40,000. And you want to calculate the map measurement. So you want the map measurement and you're given the actual distance. So for D, you're just going to take 485 meters. Okay. We want to convert this 485 meters into the distance on the map. So you're going to multiply it by 1. Okay. Divided by 40,000. Right. So 485 multiplied by 1 divided by 40,000. What do you get? Um, we actually get 0 0.012125 meters. Okay. Then how do you convert meters to centimeters? Because they want the answer to be in centimeters. You just multiply by 100. 
So the answer is equal to 1.2125 centimeters. Okay, I hope everyone is following. Okay, I hope everyone is following. Okay, I'm just going slightly a bit faster. Okay, because we have, um, you know, discussed these concepts in detail in the previous lessons. Now, let's have a look at the last one, right? Number E, right? So with number E, we are given 18 centimeters. So this is the distance on the map. We want to determine what's the distance in real life. So what are we supposed to do? We're going to multiply by what we want, which is 1 million. 235 one two three divided by one okay so what do you get as your answer you'll get that 18 multiplied by one two three five one two three you'll get 22 million two hundred and thirty thousand centimeters and then from here what do we do right we want to convert this value to be a number in meters so if you're converting from centimeters to meters what do you need to do divide by 100 so therefore our answer in meters is equal to 2 million 223 oh sorry it's not 2 million it's actually 200 222,300 um meters all right, so that is it for today's video tutorial, ladies and gentlemen, okay, where we just, you know, filling in, you know, this table where we had to, you know, convert actual um, distance on the map into distance in real life or distance in real life to distance on the map. So I hope you enjoyed this fun, you know, activity. Um, You know, I hope it, it just made everything, you know, come together perfectly. All right, so I'll see you guys on my next video tutorial where we are analyzing maps that is it guys and i'll see you guys on my next upload distance learning with lee where i make learning mathematics super easy Bye, guys.